on the part B of the exam, these are some of the tools that you'll be using to test the different types of wells. These right here are your calipers. So you would use the calipers to check maybe wall thickness or even you can use it to check the depth of the well. This right here is uh, millimeters. Um, you can find a lot of videos on how to use these calipers. Like that said at zero and every one that's five millimeters, 10 millimeters, and you keep going around, that's 20 millimeters and 25.4 millimeters equals one inch. So this is one of the tools for calipers. You also got a magnifying glass for some of us who can't see. And you got a, this gauge right here. We use this to check, you can check the internal high low on your pipe. So you just stick it inside your pipe and pull it up. And then you can take your readings to find the high low or mismatch on pipe. So this gauge, <clears throat> then you got a reinforcement gauge right here. You can use to just measure your well reinforcement. Just put it on to check your reinforcement on your cap, maybe your roots or anything else. And then you come over here and you check the reading right in here. So we know that this is a little bit over 1 32nd of an inch. So it's between the 1 32nd and the 1 8th. So that's how you check your reinforcement. You can also use this this gauge here to check reinforcement also. Uh, you just put it on and you go right here and you take your measurement. So as you can see, my measurements are on this side. So you got your metric system and your inches and we just measure that just to check your high low. You also use this measuring device and it's kind of like a tape measure. You want to take measurements. And you got a micrometer. I heard they're no longer using a micrometer, but it's good to know how to use it. This is your mic. And you can, this is a more precise reading whenever you want to check uh, wall thickness or get a little bit more precise readings, your micrometer. And this right here is your fillet well gauges. These are your fillet well gauges. So let me explain something on your fillet well gauge. Let me take this off. Okay, we got a fillet well gauge. Let's look at the, the quarter. This part of the fillet well gauge is used to measure convex, convex wells. This side is used to measure concave wells. So if we take this fillet wheel and we can look at it here, you just take your gauge and you slide it. And that's how you do your measurements. I don't know if you can see that, but that's how you use it. So you use this side right here to do your concave wells and this side right here would be your convex wheels. All right. I hope this video helped and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and have a great day.